My name is Dean Mullis. I'm an engineering equipment operator for Wilona Roads. I also work for the machine shop in El Portel. This snow is just, it's so thick and hard, there's, there's absolutely no way a actual truck plow could get through it. So what we do is we call it pioneering and we pioneer across the snow, taking off as much snow as required to get it down to cutting depth for the rotaries. And uh, you, can, you can get in some trouble real quick if, if you don't pay attention to your surroundings. My name is Kim Orr and I'm an avalanche technician and I work for the National Park Service. This is my eighth year, my eighth spring on the avalanche team and we basically come out and assess the road for the road crew and look at the avalanche sites, look at the avalanche potential and make recommendations to the road foreman on uh, what we think is safe and not safe for them to plow through. I got up at 2.15 this morning and I started work at 3 a.m. My name is Joe Menno and I work for the trail crew here in Yosemite and uh, right now I'm working with the avalanche team just to kind of just to assist them because I'm the new guy on the job. Mostly for today while they're cutting through this this avalanche zone right here I'm one of the guys who are watching on this side and then uh, Aaron Anders is watching from the other side you know facing this way and then Kim is up on top of the slope and she's watching down there and we're mostly just watching the snow to see if we hear if we hear a crack or anything like that or because when they're inside the vehicle you know they're watching the path that they're plowing so we're watching everything else that's around them you know this morning there was all this big chunks of granite on top of the snow so as soon as he started pushing the snow out of the way the granite came down into it and and so people were around just to spot and say all right there's rocks here you know so if the rocks won't get clogged up in the rotary and then we ended up seeing one that was buried in there anyways My name is Greg Lineski. I work on the search and rescue team. And I come up and staff the ambulance when they're plowing through avalanche zones. Everybody on the road has to go through the Park Service avalanche training or an avalanche refresher course if, once you've gone through the training. Um, this is an avalanche beacon right here. An avalanche beacon actually, it actually searches for someone else that has has one on as well. It uh, receives and transmits. And right now I'm on transmit. The little red button right there is is beeping so that if I was caught in an avalanche someone else could go on receive and hopefully find me in the snow. The hardest part of the operation is quitting at the end of the day because we enjoy doing what we're doing.